My favorite topic, cheap boats. Five cheap boats you can buy brand new under a thousand dollars. Now please keep in mind, I do always encourage that everybody buys used because you can save a fortune as long as you know what you're looking for. And in today's video, hopefully I'll help with that. Number one, let's go ahead and talk about my first two boats and the ones that I really like and know a lot about. So number one, and what's honestly probably going to be my number one or two recommendation is the Pond Prowler. Now these go under different brand names, the Pond Prowler, the Quest Angler, the Bass Raider, the uh, Baby Bass, all these just kind of, you know, pontoon style, two man swivel seat fishing vessels. And you can get them brand new for as low as $800 at Bass Pro with the Pond Prowler. I got mine used for $300. So anyway, the Pond Prowler is going to be a really good fishing boat that's stable, but slow. It does come with two swivel seats, two rod holders, four cleats. It's pre-wired through the hole up into the bow for a true bow mounted trolling motor and has a dedicated place to strap down your gas tank or trolling motor battery. It's very customizable, my top pick, affordable, and it's safe. So if you're brand new into boating and you don't wanna have to worry about constant weight distribution, and if you're standing up casting, if you got two people, maybe even three people, you don't wanna take up any brain space, take any time out of the moment if you're worried about tipping or dumping or falling in. That's why I picked it up for myself as a complete noob. So the Pond Prowler, I've gotta give it for the value a 10 out of 10. There's almost nothing better that you can get on the water and have the most amount of fun with that's the most beginner friendly for the price. Now, number two is moving into my second boat that I ended up selling and keeping the Pond Prowler, but I still really like it. And it has a completely different focus. That's gonna be the West Marine Water Tender coming in at $750. So listen, this is a great runaround boat. It's a great beach boat and it's much faster than the Pond Prowler uh, you know, pontoon style. It's less stable, of course, since it's a more flat bottom style. And you can fit up to three people, and it also moves a lot faster through the water than my Prowler. I had a 55 pound thrust trolling motor and was going about five miles an hour compared to the Pond Prowler at only three and a half miles an hour. I know they both might seem slow, but that is quite the speed upgrade on the water tender. This is not very good for fishing, but it's good for hauling people and gear. It's really good if you just need to get around, maybe work on a dock or maybe Maybe you need to you know, use it as a water tender and you need to use it to go to shore from your sailboat or your big boat or your yacht, or you need to run some errands, clean some stuff around your boat. This is the perfect option. It's just not gonna be that great if you plan on doing too much standing, especially with two people. Okay, number three is similar and it's the Sun Dolphin 12 foot plastic, John. Uh, you can get these from anywhere from $700 to $1,000, depending on where you look for them. So this is a 12 foot flat bottom boat. And this is a decent aluminum boat alternative. It's less stable and it can be used for fishing or hunting. It's not the best pleasure boat. So it's narrow, it's flat bottom. So you're not gonna wanna build a casting deck and start wandering around. This is not very stable. However, what you can do is you can get the clamp on, on the benches, John boat seats, attach a seat. You can have two adults, comfortably hunting or fishing. This is probably the least customizable and the least stable option. Like I said, not really a great pleasure boat, narrow and light, but if two adults remain seated, you can attach clamp on boat seats, like I said, and comfortably do what you need to do. This is a purpose-driven vessel, not really the best pleasure craft. Really quick, I wanna take a moment to thank today's sponsor to keep this show on the road. Thank you to EmpireDigest.com. They help regular people build and grow thriving online businesses so they can live their best life possible. They are part of an elite community of highly successful internet entrepreneurs on a mission to help regular everyday people break free from mediocrity and create the best life possible. Sounds similar to this channel. They're doing this by helping you start and grow highly successful location independent online businesses that provide unlimited income potential and time freedom and the ability to turn your dreams into reality faster than anything else that you've tried. Take advantage right now by clicking the first link in my description. Number four is a 12 foot inflatable Saturn boat. This boat is pretty good for really anything you would wanna do aside from hunting and fishing. You want to tend your yacht, go fast on some waves, or simply want a boat that you can deflate into the back of an SUV. These are great options because they are inflatable, so they do kind of compact a little bit, excluding the motor. These things are safe and they're hard to sink, good for ripping around some open ocean waves, trying to get to where you gotta go. This is very durable, can go fast, work on docks. It's good for working on boats, emergency rescues, snorkeling, beach hopping. It's not the best fishing or hunting vessel since it can be punctured, but this is a great 
uh, durable option if you're just looking to get out on the water and rip around and have fun and explore. Number five is going to be the Tracker Topper Aluminum. Now, this does come in at $1,400 before taxes. However, I'm kind of breaking the rules because if you can get an aluminum tracker for less than $1,000 used, you've made a great decision and probably the best decision on this channel. This boat is great for literally anything you could possibly want to do on the water within reason. I've seen these go for as low as $500 in really good condition in my area before. It's rare they go that low around me, but you might get lucky. Now these are my favorite kind of boat and will be my next project once I am finished with my current Pond Prowler build and video series. These things will basically last forever. They're light and they're rugged. All these boats, including this one, you can throw in the back of a pickup truck. Now you can customize them to be a duck hunter, a beach cruiser, or do a bass boat conversion with full decking, live wells, and maybe even a helm. Everybody knows and loves the classic John and I couldn't leave it off the potential best option for this list. So as you can see, there is actually a lot of new options out there. If you don't want to go with buying used, even though I recommend it, uh, you can go to any of these department stores or even Amazon, buy these under $1,000. And the kind of point I wanted to make was most of these boats you can buy less than $1,000 after taxes, and you still have a little bit of money left over for a cheap trolling motor and battery. So hopefully between the trolling motor, the battery, and the boat, you can get on the water brand new for under $1,000. If you'd like to see my series of building up my pond prowler and I love taking it to beautiful spots in Florida, fish and do all sorts of fun stuff, definitely hang out and stick around. Until next time, happy boating.
Thank you.